Funky whistle. Uh. Ah! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to the After Show, the Great Night Program. Woo! I guess I don't have to cough off mic. I can cough on no, mic now. Know what's going on. Yeah. Hello, uh, everybody. Welcome back to the game or to the show. Yes. For show. Uh, the the year that I got my first, uh, uh, I think I was here 10, 15 years of never having any cedar fever. It was always an other people thing. Yeah. yeah. And then <clears throat> and then when I got it, it was so bad. It, it it was one of those experiences where no matter how much you know Benadryl you name it, I just I slept with my mouth open and my lips uh, were permanently chapped. I looked like I was lost yeah. in the desert. Yeah. I saw uh, uh, there was a, a a story today. Maybe you, oh this was on KVU I think. It that uh, it, it, oh it was their Snoop's thing. Their Snoop's thing. Uh, decongestions just don't work, and we don't know how they work, but they don't work. And for a lot of people, they just don't work. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, but I, okay, but for some people. Decongestants, not, yeah, and, and some people. Some people. Some people. Or, uh, but not antihistamines? I think antihistamines. Yeah, I think antihistamines and like steroids and stuff, those are different, but but yeah. Uh, that's, uh, that's, that's stinky. That's, that's sort of like uh, having the stinky pee after you eat asparagus. Like yep. some people, it's just not oh, a problem. Yeah. Or the cilantro thing. Well, I mean, sometimes oh, yeah. that's a feature, so... How many people? It reminds you that you ate asparagus. Yeah, that's right. Oh, or, or at least lets you know via nasal press release from seven stalls over that somebody else did. Or someone yeah. else had. Uh, yeah, that's right. Uh, have it, do any of you guys have the cilantro thing where it tastes like soap? No. No. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, it's great. I once knew somebody that every time they ate beets, they'd forget about it, and then they would uh, uh, piss red, and they would be like, what the fuck? And then like, think that their kidneys were failing. Yeah. <laughs> I do that without eating beets. You piss blood? No, no sorry. <laughs> sorry. I, I've said too much. <laughs> what was uh, 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 you? You had a you had a story. You oh, I well, I wanted to bring up uh, a yeah. question for for the platform because something happened that that um, uh, my daughter uh, is making a band and stuff, and oh, nice. uh, and she had a gig at the Trail of Lights. And uh, they canceled the Trail of Lights that day because uh, of rain. Uh, uh, and it was a, a electricity hazard. And she uh, she was like really upset about it and crying. And uh, uh, I, I briefly was was wondering like, uh, well, you know, I wonder if you know we, we've we've had you know bands on and in an after show or something we could do, you know. Uh, you could give a performance that that might be fun and she was like oh my god really that'd be great and she's like so what next next t tuesday and i'm like uh well uh mm, let me check on that uh because it happened like she, she it, it was like earlier in the day uh and it was too close to the time but then as i probed i found out that they had only learned one song and it was her and a friend and they were only two weeks into practicing it and that they didn't have, they're like, well, we'll need a keyboard and a set of drums. Oh. And then, uh, uh, <clears throat> which they so don't so. currently have. Well, and then so and so could play the drums. And, I, and I'm like, who's, who's so and so? And you're like, oh, he's our drummer. I'm like, yeah, but how do you know him? And she says, well, he's the music teacher. Oh. <laughs> and then all of a sudden it was like, oh, oh, okay. So now I was like, well, sweetheart, uh, 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 here's what I want you to do I want you to practice this song so good. That me as your dad will be very proud to rent fucking equipment. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, to for, for an appearance fee for uh, you know all of that stuff. It, it suddenly turned into something very different. But I hope she, uh, you know, she's playing bass and starting to sing a little bit, and I hope she gets good enough. That's 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 my called shot. I I, I think it'd be great if she got to a place where we were happy to have her on the stream. Sometime. I think I think it would be amazing if. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've got a Photoshop here. Uh, <laughs> that's that's a photograph. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. Yep. Oh, I'm sorry. From the future. That's already happened. That's already happened. Uh, yeah. I mean, uh, it would be amazing if Josie became uh, uh, you know, a, a a musician, but that would take away from her job as a professional string flicker. <laughs> yeah. Well, fuck that's you. That's true. Fuck you. Fuck that string game. Flicker? Fuck, uh, yep. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. Want Three not. Game. Three Three do you have right? Do you have the string here? I. I thought about it just as we were starting the show <laughs> that I don't know where it is. You don't know if it's here? Let, let me call Bonnie and see if she took it home. Because if it's around, we're, we go we Go, 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 yeah, go, go make a call and, it's a and I'll, I'll fill it. So yeah. this is this is the preamble on this. So we are at Brett's Recovery Gumbo yeah, on gumbo New Year's recovery. Day. Yep. And uh, Josie is there and she is very enthralled with a piece of string. Yeah. And she's flicking the string in a way that 
I, I guess it, it kind of is like almost like static clingy or whatever. Right. And uh, uh, if you fling it a certain way, it, it can self knot. Yes. And Josie was very good at getting it to knot. Very quickly. Brian, not so much. Not so much. Not Josie was so much. enthralled by this. <laughs> yes. To the point where every time that she would make a knot, she would have her mom come over and have Brian make a uh, a, a sad face while yes. she was in exalted glory yes. next yes. to him. Uh, so I would love to watch Brian try to make a knot for as long as he would be able to do it here on the show. And the part that I found interesting is every time she had to stand on a very small, almost <laughs> yeah. stage type, like she had to perform on this stage. Like, like, stage. I, I would say like like a, a quarter of an apple box. Yes. Like it was a tiny, tiny it little. It was not very high, but it was important that she stand on that. It's yes. Like you don't have to. She goes, I'm, this is working. I'm staying here. Yeah. This is what's happening. She goes, this do you want to do it? And I said, no, I do not. <laughs> no, not. sir. I'm, I I'm, don't like it. Sorry, I'm cooking. Yeah. Right now, so, yeah. That was such a good time. It was such a good time. I was glad to have friends from all different areas of my life show up here and uh, us repeatedly tell the story of this location. And, oh, yeah. And the connection and all that. And everyone had... I mean, either they're all lying to me. Gumbo was delicious. Yeah. I had I had both varieties, yeah. and they were both uh, the bomb. Yeah, they were fantastic. Very yeah. smoky. You got a very good, very strong smoky flavor. Uh, that that the the chicken sausage definitely. I mean, because when you get the roux that dark, yeah, that's just what happens. When you get the roux that dark, man, I'm telling you, I know how to make that roux. Yeah, you just put <laughs> that in there and you eat it, and you, when it's in there, it's in there, and you just like it like that. Can I ask y'all a question? What part of the South is Benoit Blanc supposed to be from? Oh, he's oh. definitely a Georgia, yeah, he's a Georgia, Georgia Peach. It's a Georgia accent? Oh, yeah. Georgia Peach. He might Georgia as well go, I say, I say, yeah. you know. Yeah. Benoit Blanc's the best. He's a great character. Yeah. We just, we needed, uh, we needed a new flamboyant uh, detective. Yeah. And yeah, they definitely made him explicitly gay in the second one, right? In the new one. Uh, what are you doing? I think he's not. I haven't it, watched I think it yet. I mean, it's not. It like, is no, no. It's not in the movie, and it's not canonical. Well. How? How? It's not in the movie. Listen. <laughs> uh, Hugh Grant opens their shared door. Is about as explicit as oh, it gets. That's not but good. otherwise, he just that's dresses a lot better. That's does not exactly. If I signed up for an explicit website and all they did was show me two men <laughs> open the door for each other, I would be very disappointed. Well, more. Yeah. I mean, I don't Think know. About that. Did, did, Bryce, did you find him to be coded gay in the first one? Uh, not necessarily. Just no. flamboyant. Yeah, and he's got the because he's got the act. The acts. The accent allows for a lot of flower in there. Yeah. Yeah, but that's just. South. Yeah, it's just the South. Yeah. So everyone Isn't in the that... South is flamboyant? Oh, yep. yeah. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. What? Yes. I'm so... What? Really? You didn't know that? I, w I do not read everybody in the South as flamboyant. Oh. No. Wow. I mean, Louis Gohmert? Come on. Well, I'm not saying that there are not <laughs> flamboyant. I'm not saying that the South is devoid of flamboyance. I'm not saying it's a, a black hole of, of, of flamboyance. I'm just saying that it's not universally flamboyant True. okay uh True. i have i have wonderful news uh the string is not here <laughs> <I'm> good because <laughs> that, that was gonna be 20 to go more minutes, two more hours yeah. i just didn't <laughs> want to yeah <laughs> did you get any better at it brian sucked at it and his daughter was really good and, yep you know. uh and and more more importantly Justin, uh, look, when Justin heckles, uh, he can make it funny, but, but, ooh, there's nothing more scathing than low effort heckling from Justin. <laughs> <laughs> just, just sort of holding his drink, just watching. That and then, and then, and then, uh, and then finally, after like a minute, he goes, oh, landed on your hand that time. <laughs> <laughs> And then just hung over, <laughs> just just taking shots, yeah, just, like just fine. sitting on the bench, like. Fine. And then uh, uh, on top of that, uh, then, then it becomes a running bit, the, or like a minute later, he's like, "I do it, landed on your hand again. That was good. <laughs> you're like uh, the Michael Jordan of landing it on your hand. Yeah, that was definitely. And then you're, and then Jesse was like, like, 
she caught on to the bit and she was also <laughs> ma- mocking you. And then she's like, yeah, you're the Michael Jackson of getting it on your hand. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. Oh, that's oh. clever. That's yeah. fun. That and now hey, that's funny. <laughs> now that's what I call goofs. Uh, I, uh, I think I think what I said was, uh, uh, yeah, Michael Jackson came down from a particular sub brand of heaven. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just, just very just segmented. <laughs> very segmented. Sure. Wow. Uh, it's only one hundred forty-four thousand. Fred, do you have any awards? Oh. Yes, I have the most positive on the show award goes to Justin. Yep. And uh, the more, the most who looks like a farmer in shorts is me. <laughs> oh, you do? Seems to be. You uh, you do. It's like you arrived on a tractor. Yeah. <laughs> listening to our podcast. I was, I was listening to your podcast. Or you look like a trucker on vacation. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Or on, on maybe they have trucker casual Friday. Really? You're doing a slow pan up? Come on now. Yeah. Oh. Take oh. it in. Yeah. It's all you gotta, me, you baby. Let the judges have a moment here at the uh, I need a haircut. annual Brett trucker looking. Brett, are you gonna? You, you've grown your hair back out. Are you gonna shave it? When's the next shave? Uh, did you I'm like to shave? Get a haircut. I mean, I'm not. I'm not doing the thing that I did before. So sure. Can we shave it anyway? Can we shave it? No, anyway? he no. doesn't like it shaved. Oh, I thought you did like it shaved. Uh, no, because oh. I look too intimidating and too intimidating. Nobody, oh. nobody thought, will approach. I, guess maybe that I, says to, uh, I thought that was for a good audio thing. listeners. He grabbed his notepad defensively. Yeah, I looked too. Intimidating. (laughs) (laughs) I mean, okay, so real talk here. Yeah. My whole life I've been a big guy. Yeah. And and sometimes I can have feel you, bro. I can have resting bitch face too. So there are times that people have been intimidated by me, and that's the thing that I've never wanted to be. So except in the moments where I really need I want everybody to know everything's great until that one moment. But other than that, I, you want to be the one to flip the switch yes. and you don't want the preconceived notions Absolutely. of yeah. I had too many years of people thought that either I was a dumb football player oh. Or there, or I was some guy that's gonna start a fight. I, I yeah. imagine like, that's nothing not that Brett would like least than uh, to find out that the reason that nobody talked to him at the party is because they were afraid of him. Yes. <laughs> Oh, is that what happened? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I'm cooking. Leave me alone. No, no, no. Not your party. Oh, just yeah. any party. Or, or you oh, talk- yeah. No, no. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. The, at, at the party. Yes, the, at the yeah, party. Yeah. yeah. The party. Because you are, you are, I mean, you're an actor. You're somebody that likes communicating with yes. people. You like mixing it up. And yeah. so, like, if, if everybody was kind of orbiting around you but not engaging, that would be would hell. Suck. That's like, yeah, it's the yeah. worst. Yeah. Then then after a while, I'm like, you got, hi, hi, hi. I'd uh so you you're here at the party too, huh? And then and then it's just it's a spark. Did you ever go through a phase where you wanted to match the energy for which the universe was putting upon you, and you're like, yeah, I am, I am, uh, I am the law. When, <laughs> in my in wow. my twenties, when I would go to the club, yep, uh, there would be times where I was like, yeah. Posting up, posting. I was a doorman for yeah. a while. I, I was a bouncer. And so you were like, just not gonna take shit, right, bro? What's up? I, I mean, I, I, I was a doorman at a couple places, and I was, I always outsmarted the ruffians who were causing trouble. So it was never physical. It was always just like, all right, time to go. It was energy. Yeah, you know, you would just maybe a firm, a firm hand on the shoulder. I did that to one guy. Yeah, yeah, who was, uh, uh, he was, uh, 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 he was saying dirty things to uh, the waitresses in French. Oh, really? Yes. Uh, Oh, yeah. Remember this was at the Gingerman. Yeah, this was at the Gingerman in Houston. Okay. And uh, little did he know that a lot of us understood French. (laughs) And so, and that'll get you kicked from the well, club. Well, because the waitress said this guy is just really being filthy, and I'm like, all right, I'll take care of it. So I, I came. And did he try he to was, plead his case? No. While he was doing it, I came back around and I came up from behind him and I put my hand on his shoulder and I go, "Allons, say, vite, vite, uh, allons. Yeah, oh, yeah. that's good. That was it. I was like, "Allons, vite." And he's like, "Okay." Oh ah, shit! Yeah, I was just ah. done. <laughs> Fucking now, I gotta be your guest somewhere else. I guess. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, uh, that's that's interesting. So that I mean, I guess it was like a vocation. Yeah, your your, your, your intimidating looks uh, uh, got you paid. Yeah, I mean, I wanted to be the bartender, but uh, 
Did you want to get into that flair? I want that kid. Did you want to no, you want to do some, this some was, cocktail shit? I could oh, see you. Yeah. No, you you, you very much that. would have some cocktail. I did a little like, bit. There were times I did a little bit of that. The spinning and the yeah. perfect pour and the... And then do like the, like the, the eight shots. Yeah, the like, four across the eight. Shot, that, lighting them all on fire and then shoving it in. And there. then, yeah, like, and then you take one like, shh, but it's really like, <laughs> yeah, like water. <laughs> you yeah. say, shh, you forget to put it out. You just yeah. pour it yeah, on Yeah, pour it hot. just yeah. bodies on fire. Uh, and then it was like, whoops. Ah! And, and you're like, shh. And then you throw, and then, and then you throw confetti, and you're in a new dress. Yes, <laughs> that's absolutely right. Yeah. Wow, you knew. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the Montrose Mining Company, the good old days. <laughs> anyway. Oh my God. Oh, sorry. Wait, Do you want to? Uh, all right. So if you were to, somebody suggesting that like we could have an event where you live your dream and you are the flair guest bartender at at. The next Founders Day. Uh, we have just enough time for me to remember how to do all of that stuff. <laughs> oh, I mean, and, and we have an outdoor. We have a lot of fire extinguishers. So <laughs> we. I feel like you would need a persona, yeah. like you would need a name, like you, like it can't just be like bartender Brett, because bartender Brett, like that, that, you're 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 you're, you're in just, a dive bar, right? You're just a good old. You're That's like what I love. Crack crack. Like, hey man, what's going what on? Yeah, I'm yeah. giving you a little this bit one, extra. This How one's on me. Yeah. That's bartender Brett. But if you're Flair, you're like hey, Brian. Lady. Brian, are right, here. No, just a uh, 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 Brett. Just just go ahead and, and yeah. raise both hands over your shoulders, like like you're doing that. Uh, uh, Not the shake. Big, weight. big 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 smile. <laughs> what who is? What's that guy's name? Oh, Teddy. That's Teddy. Cool. I like it. Uh, I Teddy like it. Confetti. Teddy Confetti! <laughs> and then whenever he hands you the drink, he does a little... I know everybody hammer. else is happy about that. I'm not so much, but I'll, I'll go with I the mean, wishes. I mean, it's not you. It's a persona. I know. It's I'll a go role. with the wishes of the crowd. Yeah. I'm Teddy Confetti. How Back many? Story, I'm oh my Teddy God. Confetti. Hey, everybody. <laughs> when he got started off, he or he was a, he originally made blizzards, and so the first few times he made drinks, he'd dump them upside down. I did, <laughs> yeah, I did work at I did Origin work Story. at Dairy Queen for a while, so yeah. that was yeah. okay, yeah. true. Well, oh shit! Uh, oh, that that was a masterful touch of storytelling to to have it be in the style guide of the blizzard that that you would hand it and go, "Psych, no, it's fine." It's a, yeah. <laughs> oh, let me get you another one. Yeah. Well, and it's not a psych anymore. Now it's like, no, flip it. Flip, flip that yeah, shit. Flip it. Please flip it. If you yeah. don't flip it, then well, what did I pay for? I know the blizzard has got to be concrete. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> it's like, don't worry. You won't be able to eat it till you get home. <laughs> yeah. It's like the, the, the instant first brain coffee. freeze. Here you go. They, uh, uh, do you know how they make dipping dots? Have we, have we talked about dipping They go dots? to space. The ice cream go. of the future. It's right up in space. Yeah, they go to space, man. That's I assume right. it's just, it's a fried, a fr uh, fr fried ice. <laughs> uh, fried ice. <laughs> So yep. What, what is yep. Fried ice. Yep. The fried ice. Yep. Fried ice. Oh fried my ice. god! Yep. It took me a Absolutely long time to get right. there. I love telling <laughs> me a shrimp fried this ice. No. <laughs> <laughs> but is it like? Is it a dried ice thing? Uh, n uh no. It, it actually. It uh, the reason they're perfect spheres is because they drop. Uh, and I think Curtis Larock in the chat has it right. That they, they drop, they're dropped into a bath of liquid nitrogen. That's right, ice. They, and they keep filling it up until oh. five, and then they then they just have it, let it remain frozen, and then you get that weird dust. Yeah, those are great, man. Maybe that's roll. All I right. never, I never liked it. Me neither. Really? Over overrated. Textural weirdness. Oh. I don't like it. it oh yeah. But but yeah. it doesn't like, look like it should taste like ice cream, but it does have a very ice cream consistency. Yeah, yeah. It, like it, like so much so that you go through all this bullshit and you're like, "Wow, I should have just bought ice cream." Ice cream. cream. Yeah. Well, but but then it also because of the surface area, it becomes ice cream. It, it's it's something that's not ice cream and Until... just the, and then a second later it is ice cream and then it's just liquid you swallow. <laughs> what is the process? <laughs> Cough, hack, fart. <laughs> Don't forget the silent. Yeah. Excuse me. Act call, you guys want to do an outtake? Silent. I got I got a few outtakes from the game. Would sure. Shit my own pants. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so that's yes. All right, here is one. Uh, what is the highest mountain peak in a chew? Sorry. Uh oh, uh, uh Pike Pike's Peak. I was gonna say Pike. Uh, like? uh uh Denali. Denali? Justin. Uh, Kilimanjaro. Nah, we were we would have been looking for Everest. Mount Everest. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Mount Everest. Yeah. 
But would then what would the words have been? In uh, the world? In the world, yeah. In the world. Yeah, I Severus. guess I would track. Oh, yeah. yeah. I guess the, the world. The world. <laughs> Close but no cigar. Uh, Close but no. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> who, who are at the play? Phlegm cough. Oh. <laughs> Shakespeare. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say Shakespeare. Uh, what do you guys think? Al that was Albert that was Albie. Album. Albert Albie? Yes. Albie. Uh, 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 I don't know any player. Uh, Lin Manuel Miranda. Oh, okay. Good. Right. We were looking for William Shakespeare. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's great. Once again, see for what was, what was someone who hates what, the what game. Was, what was the real one? It was a Hamlet. Hamlet. Oh, good. Phlegm cough. Phlegm, phlegm <laughs> Very cough. Very close. It was just like the virus. It was, was so smart. it was, it was, it was uh, hyphenated. Maybe it was. So. It was actually. Yeah. If you if you looked at my if you look at my documents, it actually is. Oh wait, no, you guys can see it right there. Yeah, there it is. I forgot you can see my documents. Yep. <laughs> my yeah. documents are data. Yeah. You know, could you tuck? I can see your documents. <laughs> <laughs> can we work on Teddy Confetti's voice? <laughs> <laughs> Because well, you went, because you went, you went really like, like kind of like Professor Frinky. Anime. No, 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 no. no, no. You got to be like, hey, you ladies. That's yeah. So close. glad to see so, you today. So closer, closer to there, but take it down. Like, like you have like bit, fucking like, like real like, like you've got a a superior confidence and you can flip a a, a, a shaker bottle. thing. Yeah. Nineteen eighties DJ giving traffic and weather together. Yeah. <laughs> I know someone that sounds just like that. <laughs> and we'll be doing it. Uh, we'll be making drinks on the hour, yeah, just, everyone. Just that's it. Lowe. That's it. That's it. That's it. <laughs> just what? Just do George Lowe. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, as always, what's my trigger word for yeah. him? Which yeah. is, well, hello, citizen. <laughs> hello, citizen. And uh, here we are with uh, panty pudding on the hour. <laughs> We're uh, going to be uh, doing bacon panties. It's all panties. All hour. And I'm going to be yeah. making you drinks. He loved saying the word panty. Panty, yeah. yeah. Still yeah. does. Still does. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> the one time I met him. I don't yeah, oh, no. Dead. Uh, yeah. He said it like five times. He's, yeah. Uh, he, I think he wrote it on our on our autograph <laughs> yeah. thing. Yeah. Because he wouldn't get, he, like, we got like five words into explaining the bit. And he goes, so you're, and he leans back, crosses his arm and says, uh, so you're saying you're not going to give me a goddamn dollar. <laughs> <laughs> and we're like, no, we'll, we'll buy a signature. He's like, all right. <laughs> yeah. My 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 name. He, whenever he talks to me, my name is Bream, Bream, and uh, Ek. It's Elizabeth. <laughs> it's Bram and Elizabeth. <laughs> <laughs> why? Like, you're Just a curious, because. Curious that's why. character, that yep. man. Teddy Love Confetti. That. Is he fast talking or slow talking? He's probably. Uh, he, he lets he lets this uh, drink and making. Do the talking. Do the talking. So he's a little bit more introverted than you might think. Yes. Yeah. He, he definitely gives the smiles. Okay, He's yep. generous with the smiles. Uh, well, not big on the talk. Let me give you a pitch. Teddy Confetti never talks. You go, you go up, you ask for what you want, mm -hmm. and he always responds with, and then he makes it, and he sets it down, and then he lazily throws some confetti on, on top of it. That's no, not, because the no. Gen he, X, Teddy Confetti? Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> I am Gen X, but nah, I think he'd probably just be more like, can confirm. And then just makes the thing and it's like that, 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 and here and the light on fire, and then then he does it like the oh, salt. Does dye. he? Does he have a salt bay? Yeah. Salt bay. Yeah. Uh, does Does he have a, a catchphrase like bam or no or or, or whoopee or? Well, he's got the confetti. Or he's got I a mean, visual no, catchphrase. No, yeah. on their no that's what he does. <laughs> he puts the, the the confetti in his hand and he goes, <laughs> and, and he. Coughs it out onto the the drink. Alternately, I, I don't I don't think we're selling this VIP event for Founders Day. <laughs> no. uh, maybe we have a bunch of uh, 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 those New Year's Eve horns that are loaded with confetti, and then yeah, very, you know the drink is done when you hear. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty good one. Yeah. yeah, or he sets off one of those uh, one of those confetti crackers every time he finishes his drink. Oh, I like that. Well, yeah, I actually, no. All right, here, no. Now I'm into, I'm into the, yeah. the the New Year's Eve blower thing, but he has it up his sleeve, and so like he, he just, like pop pop pop, throwing the vodka over his shoulder, yep. pouring it out. Yep. Like here you go, and then mm, pulls with his mouth out of his sleeve. Little magic comes. Yeah, comes the 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 thing. <laughs> oh, that's the other thing. Does it? It's go very Joe Blue. That's down? me is farting. It, <laughs> or is it? <laughs> 
Well, no, because it's not anti-comedy, right? Yeah, like, like goes, he, he's Teddy Confetti. Goes, he's he a wants to go dark. Me. He keeps wanting to go dark. I know. Origin. He's like, oh, okay. what about Teddy Confetti's dark past? Yeah, like, like want, he, want, he still remembers I mean, that one night at Akron. I would like to believe that Confetti that killed his parents. Yeah, he, and he's, because he's of that, his best he took life. their name. <laughs> yes, so, he's he's a former Navy SEAL who's now living his best life as Teddy Confetti. Yes, is what I'd like. They keep. Pulling me back in. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I want to stop <laughs> and making and, drinks. And, and, and as eat. he's shaking up yet another Cosmo, all the, the 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 ice slowly turns into machine gun fire. <laughs> <as> he remembers. <laughs> Back in Nom. <laughs> Barman. Confetti, you go over that bridge. <laughs> Theodore, confetti, you go right now. <laughs> Yes. You've already lost uh, 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 air horn, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, juggling, uh, 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 magic wand, and uh, shiny shoes. I'm already. Yeah. I'm always drawn back to the screaming of the confetti guns. And then it's just like, like, excuse me, excuse me, and then the music comes. It comes huh? Give me oh. a high alarm. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, oh, oh. Anyway, oh. Yeah. here's your Cosmo. Here. Oh, <laughs> God. Have an apple teeny. All right. Is that All right? It? Yeah. I think that's I think it. That's we it. did it. Yeah. Well, thank you everybody for joining us. We'll be back next Tuesday with another great night. Hope you guys yeah. are having a great 2023. Yes. Mr. President, I'm sorry. There's no bartender. <laughs> Slams desk. Get me Teddy confetti. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. Have a good rest of your week. Goodbye. See you. Love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>